Howdy folks, Matthias here, and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. When last we left off, we uh, fell to our deaths, and we're, our checkpoint was very far away. So I came back, we changed up a few things. Um, a new shirt, new little more matrixy coat. And we had some mods on each. And we had this legendary rev power revolver, which is better, which had more damage output than the... Uh, other gun, the legendary gun, still the power shotgun. And what I wanted to do, get down here if I can. Game. Oh my goodness. Take me down. There we go. Alright, you. This ammo. I just wanted to craft you up if I can. And this makes no noise whatsoever. Just. Really weird. Alright, we don't need rifle ammo. Maybe we're good on shotgun shells for right now. Um, as far as character ability stuff, let's go ahead and get reflexes up and keep going into handguns. Pistols and revolvers to enemies 5 plus meters away by 15%. I think definitely that because we are definitely. Definitely try to keep as much distance from them as possible. We're gonna have a lot of. Yeah, sure, why not keep that up? Alright, let's see if we can get this thing done. Looks like we're still around the same time as before, 6 o'clock. Let's see if this is early morning enough. Rare components, very nice. Anything else? A gag. Ah, oh, yeah, I'm not gonna take that. Mitch Anderson. We're holding a funeral for. Oh, yeah, this is. Or in others, so maybe you wanna come along so you can buy a fire rifle near to honor the fallen and so on. Okay. Hey, Judy. Alright, not gonna follow my death. There we go. Hey, V. Talking with Michael is like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. Some deets about her could be useful when I talk to her. Don't you think? I'm stuck in crouch. No, leave the talking to me. Okay. You seem a bundle of nerves. I have a mind to kill the bastards with my bare hands. So yeah, you could say I'm a teensy bit nervous. Okay. Mm -hmm. How do you aim to get her over to our side? By telling the truth about Evelyn, what happened and why. Think that'll cut it? No. Have to improvise from there. Okay. All right. I'm ready. Let's go. I'm always up for improv. Hold on. I'll open it. Okay. All right. Ladies first. How are you opening panel? Okay. A lock like that? No way you cracked it open on your first try. You know how to get around their systems? Appears so. Was hoping they hadn't run any updates since I left. Looks like I was right. Easy as pie, yeah. Okay. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yep, bet I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mock. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. Consorting with a common thug. Hey. Yes, V. I mean you. Don't mind me. Just here to blend into the decor. That's no reason. Why come at all? To make sure Judy gets what she came for. Jude would have had a better chance without you. Judy has a proposal. About clouds. Want to come back? Done. You always valued your skills, you know that. Just don't get why you had to drag this... 
loose end in here. Stop treating dolls like meat and I'll consider it. But first things first. Clouds needs to be taken from the tiger claws. Okay, look. It's clear what happened to Ev was traumatic. Huh? I was convinced you didn't know. Well, then... That girl was asking for an unhappy ending. I was just surprised it took so long. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious and sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Okay, since you seem more reasonable... Can uh, I'm not gonna be... I'm not gonna be reasonable. Judy's idea. Think about it. It could work. Well, well, Jude. See, you found a true and loyal fan. You aware what Woodman did to Evelyn when she was desperate for help? You sit by, let that happen? Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? About as much as you two and your problems mean to me. Greed is negligible. Doesn't it make you wonder why you even work here? I'm trying to find a good angle. Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. And so you don't think I'm brushing you off completely? Forrest will be on the maintenance level in a couple minutes. Alone. So you're giving me that piece of shit? What is this? Book collection. Be able to grab these now? Ah, oops. Just grab stuff and accidentally broke stuff. Alright, I guess they're out of here. Let's have a look. Thanks for the date. And I scroll like it's not gonna happen. Please like personally it's me. I realize I'm not ready for a commitment yet. Interesting. Take your shit. D Alvarez. You know, you'll do better with problems than actual key tell when you're coming, I'll leave a bag. Fox won't answer telling you time just so we're clear. Trash, give shit about it, not common. Throw everything out like trash. No remorse, no regrets. If you find any of my shit, feel free to hand it. Leave it on oh, Jake Duke for the people who need them. It's very close. You could jump burn this, so I should just rather just burn it. She left a lot of messages for Mako. Right? That's the same person that we just talked to. Is Mako? They have like a relationship thing. And you realize what a piece of shit she was? Something expenses, huh? Yeah, she has a thing for Judy. And it's creepy. That went smoothly. Where'd she go? She totally blew us off. Probably needs time to think. A couple of days, tops. Yeah, you might be right. I'll call her tomorrow. Hey, it's a bad idea, Judy. Really creepy, those messages and shit I saw. Alright. <laughs> Freaking V. Whenever he doesn't make a jump, it looks so pathetic. I need, may I remind you we're still in a hostile area? You two have a history? They do. Way back, yeah. Think 
Jessica just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. And so was I. Can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. The line between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, used to have a big crush on her. Took me a long time to realize who she really was. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. <sighs> Just think, could have gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good, too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding. Not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah, you, a deck chair, and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella? Somehow I don't see it. No, me and the deck chairs, me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. Just going all the way to the elevator. Or, yep, yep, elevator it is. Wait a sec. What about Woodman? What do you want to do? Well, what do you want to do? I want somebody to unload lead into his face till there is no face. <laughs> until there somebody. is no face. Fine. Want you to do it. Sure, he's gonna be there. You met Michael. That prick still works here. It's cause he follows her orders pretty damn precisely. Don't have an ounce of sympathy for that motherfucker. So, we go in there? Damn straight. Let's end him. We'll take the elevator. Quickest way. All right. Maintenance level. All right, let's do this. How AD has crashed outside of Night City. You know what's worse than a corpo? A wannabe corpo bitch. You mean Maiko? Yeah, you're talking about Maiko. Piece of work, that one. But I'll give her credit. She's dead on about your chances of pulling this off. By a band of nomads. Fortunately, Kang Tao's surviving security personnel managed to fend off the attack without suffering any losses. All right, where's Woodman? Here you are, you little piece of shit. Oh, Judy, hi. Where's Maiko? What'd you fucking call me here? Hey. Evelyn's dead. Come here just to tell me that. It's fucking kind of you to remember. Here. Go light a candle. When Evelyn needed help, you raped her. Could have also broken her neck. Hung up her head like a chandelier till it started to rot. <laughs> Instead, I took her to a ripper. Wish you a little something in return. She should be grateful. And so should you. You piece of shit. Hmm. Here's my token of gratitude. Our king. Oh, man. We are really gonna blow his face off, huh? So there is no more face. Look at his freaking face. You stop freaking moving, huh? Well, revolver works well, wouldn't you say? Feel more. Be satisfied. Punch the ground floor to get out of this place. Almost felt like the world would be a better place once you died. No. And the feeling? It was so fucking strong. The aircraft's thrusters were deactivated by sudden EMP discharge from a nearby damaged The world did change, though. All the people he could have hurt, they're all safe now. 
Think of that. They'll never even know they were in danger. Okay. Seems very part ways. Or are we gonna do something else? We got a fast travel thing that is calling my name. Uh poor Judy. Ain't a fucking chick. Cyberpunk sucks. I, back to Michael with something big. I feel into her sense of justice wasn't big enough. Michael only works with specifics. A minute there. Thought you were about to call it quits. V. I go for days tuning virtues in a basement. Know what the chances are of somebody blowing my head off down there? Minuscule? Same as Michael's empathy. Unlike you, I don't put myself out there. But this ain't over. Not yet. You know, I'm also partial to specifics. Uh-huh. So that's what matters. How many you'll drop. How much ammo you'll use. How many eddies it'll get you. Art and dreams of freedom can't be everyone's food. Sometimes, you gotta deal with the dirt. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. I'll call you when I've got some. See you later, V. And thanks. Okay. Uh, there's another meeting with Takimura. Yeah, still gotta meet with Takimura. Alright, so... Bart Moss. Call Ozob. Then in the clouds, huh? I love the names for these freaking quests. They're very nice. They're all like... These are all freaking, like, titles and lyrics to songs, right? Get kill in the name of, uh, send in the clowns. Boots are made for walking. Say to man, where are you going to come to do? I have the law on the law one. Um, don't know about this one. Use the thrill, happy together, psycho killer. Yeah, it's like all this, all these side jobs for the most part. I'm sure there's these are songs that I don't know, but majority of these I recognize these as 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 you know, as songs. So they're fun. What should we do? Bill Jablonski. Yeah, I don't want to do that yet. Old Ride was total for good. Like a phoenix for the ashes lives. But now, why now? Close the chapter of kicking up sands with nomads out in the desert. It'd be stupid if you didn't check it out. They were on their state of the past. But it shows your shit likes to take revenge. Interesting. So where is this? Out in the moon knocks. There's a very high danger over there too. Uh, let's check it out. Let's see. Let's do it. All right, we got a fast travel point. Yes, we do. Let's take it. Let's do this. Um, see how long it takes us to do this. If it's pretty quick, we might find one more other thing to do, and screw around. Or, you know, screw around till Judy calls. Got to wait and see. Meantime, I guess we're gonna call over Scorpion. Where are you going, bud? Turn this way. There we go. Hello, buddy. Alright, first things first. We got a stash? Yes. What I wanna do is I wanna take the sniper rifle, transfer. Right? Is that transfer? We don't make a transfer. Did that? Can they not? That's like move them. 
Apparently that's not gonna work. Whatever. I don't know why, but it's not working. No, we look super weird with the long jacket. Go ahead and top off. Avi, I have some new work for you. A certain item needs to be salvaged from the landfill before some gonks chop it to pieces. I've attached some more details for you. Okay. Gig type thievery. Broken training bot. Real piece of work, huh? Alright, so let's do this first. What a dump. Holy crap. Like, oh. It's been a damn long while, old friend. Oh, it's my old car. we got here. Yeah, let's have a look, shall we? Fenders and trunk eaten away by rust. The rest of the body's still holding up. Wonder what's under the hood. It's warm. Engine was running just a short while ago. Yeah, somebody's been running it. New coil, plugs. Somebody's clearly been tinkering with the camshaft. What's this now? Let's check the oil pan. Huh. New, but used. Salvaged from some other junker. New, but used, huh? Someone cleaned the cooling fan. Filled up the brake fluid. Except... Huh. With water. All right. Seen enough. Hey, what the... Hands off my car! The... What? No, it's my car. No, why would you leave it rusting in a yard? Because it broke down, and I... And you abandoned it, and now, out of nowhere, you remembered you left it. Likely story. This last week, I put in sweat, smarts, anything to get this heap running. Should have started with the step motor. Would have been quicker. Says who? And why? Because it's iffy. Starts sticking. Clear the carbon deposits, and it starts running like new again. Fuck! I replaced the entire throttle. Ah, oh, see? Takes the owner to really know a set of wheels. Former owner? Car's mine now. As soon as I'm done doing the basic fixes, I am leaving this fucking city in a cloud of exhaust. You seem desperate. Why you want to leave? No way you'd understand if you have to ask. Come on. Try me. Tell me. Tell you what, damn it! Look around you! Dirt, rot, shit, and scum! I don't want to live here. Not now. I'll buy this car off you. Pay enough so you can get another. But it, it's a wreck. Uh-huh. My damn wreck. Come on. Take the cash before I change my mind. Jeez. Thanks. I'm not sure what to say. <laughs> so give it a think. While I take this baby for a ride. Alright. Good, we can have that. Let's... Hello. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like clockwork. Well, definitely no guy or girl magnet. But seems healthy under the hood. Baseball Don't know bat. It. Wait till I open her up. Not afraid you might. Ah, what can it hurt? I'm dead anyway. Floor it, V. All right. <laughs> Ooh, okay, so that didn't take long at freaking all. And this thing, we already dropped. <laughs> Floor it, V. Yep, that's what happens. Thanks, Johnny. Alright, does that show up on our thing now? It 
does. They got two. Why do we have Galenas? I guess that's a type of car. All right. So yeah, that was fun, wasn't it? I just gave a hundred bucks to scrap it yet again. Sparring partner. That's a very high one. We don't want to do that right now. What we want to do? I'm gonna find something else to do. I like sending the clowns. I want to call Bozo Bozo. See what's up there. Let's do that. Where is Bozo Bozo? Hey Bozo Bozo. It's V. Heard you had a gig for me. You heard right. I need a driver. Mm hmm. And for what exactly? Oh, you know, this and that. I got a few errands to run. A couple of friends that need paying a visit. The usual. Listen, I'm a straight shooter, so let me cut right to the chase. I heard you're the best in town. Thing is, I like working with the best. And I know the best don't come cheap. I'm not gonna get into the nuts and bolts, cause if what they say about you is true, you can handle anything. So let's get this settled. You got what it takes, or are they wrong about you? Yeah, I'll take the All gig. Right. I'm in. Japan town then. By the market entrance. Give a few honks and I'll stroll up. Later, V. Yeah, let's see if I can call him up. No? No? Alright, we're gonna do it. Gonna, oh, no, mustache. Get on the... There we go. That's much better. All right. A long way to go. We need to get to that uh, fast travel point. I think it's just straight up, right? Yep. Let's see what this is about. Look at that. Oh, there you go. That's it going there already. Got your little. Oh, what's that? You take that ashtray. Why not? Alright, who we got? Hey guys, how about you guys have some. have some of that? They hurt like hell. Hello. Open. Thank you. Oh, hey, guy. Can you, can you not? No, 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 no. Are you freaking... Dag damn it. Man, this guy hurts. Yeah, neither am I. Shit. Thanks, stranger. That was a close one. Yeah, I'm securing evidence, alright. Looks like evidence again? This one? I don't know what that does. Crescent shard gain XP for handgun skill. Is that what we get from that? I guess, I don't know. I just had stuff to do. See what that's like for uh, for once. What did we miss? Nothing. All right, let's head over. Apparently, we got more health now. Let's go ahead and level up real quick. Level 19. Still don't know what the hell we do anything with that at all. Our text 12, and we've pretty much been. Good from there. Do like what does cool do? Cold blood and stealth. I mean, we're just not gonna be into that at all. Body. I mean, if we get past annihilation level six, maybe. 
I don't know what that would do for us. So let's go ahead and just up reflexes again. Just keep going to handguns. 25%. Okay. I'm gonna go here. Let's go ahead and use. Let's go to this one. Get our car. And then go say hello to Bozo Bozo. I was gonna keep calling him Bozo Bozo because that's his freaking name. I don't know how to say Bozo backwards. Literally the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Alright. Firm. Car. There you are. Hey, buddy. You went right next to the cops, really? Uh, can't get a break. Seriously, went right next to the cops. Thanks, car. Why am I going this way? Whoa, what is my car doing? <laughs> Super fun. Well, well. At least we weren't issued. We're having problems. I was in the Outlands too long. Where do they want us to go? Oh, there's another one gone. Goodness. Go. Get out of here. Parking spot. Let's go here. And I'm parking in a different location. Honk? How do we honk? We honk. How do we honk? Give me inside, how do we honk? Nope, can't do that. How do we honk? What the fuck, how do we honk? I can't. Give me honk. Seeing anything? Yeah, I'm pressing. Like what button do I press? Is that a honk? Okay, that's honk. Left trigger is honk. Hey, you're V. Yes. Whoa! Whoa! Fuck! You didn't answer my question. Uh. There's, uh, something on your face. The grenade. Can I ask why? You have a juggling accident or something? Not cool. You ask personal questions and yet you haven't even introduced yourself. You are V, correct? Yep. Yeah, that's me. Good, then let's go. Where to? Little China. I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. What the hell? <laughs> what? Some people. Okay. Doesn't it bother you? What? The grenade. You know, the one on your face. Uh, you get used to it. I just gotta be careful not to pull the pin when I want to pick my nose. <laughs> what nose? Your nose is a grenade. Good God. Nice out here. A lot of stuff has changed. Where are you from? Brazil. You know, down in South. I know where Brazil is. <laughs> you never know with you gringos.
What the heck? You want me to turn that way? Your claws. Heard of them? <laughs> Who has? Hasn't. Yeah. Seriously. Got any friends in there? No. No. Why? Just asking. Can't help being curious. Yeah. If you're going up the tire claws, be my guest. All right. Just straight ahead. And then on the right. Parking spot should be right at this turn. Here we go. This is the place. Wait for me here and keep the engine running. Came all this way to get takeout. You could say that. And it's gonna take someone out. Can't switch camera. Oh, there he is. Okay, we can see what he's up to. Alright, let's see what happens. Ha! <laughs> Thought so. What are you doing? What the fuck was that? You got grenades up your ass, too? Seriously? Want a taste of this asshole? Uh. Can't take him out or what? <laughs> you... All right. The hell. Ha! Not bad, right? It would have been even better if you told me what you were planning from the get-go. <laughs> it's true what they say. You're good. Really fucking good. Got a stick up your ass, though. This is where we part ways. Good luck, V. And, uh, relax a bit. Okay? Now, are you gonna tell me about the grenade? Oh, that. My brother ripped it off during a fight. With pliers. Ooh, one happy family. Huh. You don't know the half of it. I could have chipped another one, but... I don't know. I think this matches my style more. Uh-huh. Besides, it's a real icebreaker with the ladies. Got any powder for my nose? <laughs> and does it work? Not really. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. What about my payment? What about it? Here, like I said before, the best don't come cheap. Take care, V. And hey, keep your nose to the ground. Ha uh ha. -huh. You're f fucking hilarious. Alright, let's just take a look here. And I'll have a look at that. And look at that. Alright, so let's go ahead and end off there. That was a lot quicker than I thought it would be. Um, I thought, as he said, it was like we were going to take him around town. So I thought he was going to like send us on like multiple errands. Not just one. But hey, that was an interesting little side character. Bozo. Anywho, we'll see if we meet any more interesting characters like that next time. So till next time, this has been Desaios signing out for now. Bye, folks.